Hey guys, your Nintendo Nerd Shadow here, and welcome to the first episode of Super Mario Galaxy. Now, I really love this game. It's probably, I'd say maybe my second favorite 3D Mario to Odyssey, because I really, I really like this game. And the music is just brilliant. It's just amazing. I even sleep to this music, it's that good. So, let's get right into Super Mario Galaxy. Let's go, and... There's my completed file on all 121 stars. So, yeah, I don't know. Is there a way to get three crowns? I, d I don't know. I tried looking it up, but no one said anything. But I got two crowns because I don't know how to get three. Someone in the comments, please tell me if there's a way to get three crowns. Because I researched it, and apparently everyone said there's only two. But I might be wrong. Anyway, let's start. New file, file two. Create a game file for this planet and apparently you can't use me's for some reason which is dumb which is only mario yoshi toad and peach even though there's more than four planets so that would be very confusing that you can't use me's in this which i don't understand anyway second file i'll just make mario let's um let's do this saving okay we got the mario planet let's play this file let's go I really love this game. I love this game. Every 100 years, a comet appears in the skies above the Mushroom Kingdom. The comet was so large. One year, it filled the skies and sent countless shooting stars raining down. The toads brought the shooting stars to the castle where they became a great power star. It should have been a very happy time for the citizens of the Mushroom Kingdom. That was the night of the Star Festival, held once every 100 years to celebrate the Comet. Dear Mario, I've been waiting for you at the castle on the night of the Star Festival. There's something I'd like to give to you. Wink wink from Peach. <laughs> it's like the wink wink. <laughs> Here we go in 1080p, but I'm only doing this in 720 because my capture card doesn't like 1080p. Okay. And I, I'm not I'm not joking about um sleeping to this music. I literally sleep to this music. It's that good. Um. Okay. Let's go. Let's go, we don't really, there's nothing really to do here, so we can just keep moving. We can just get some star bits, but that's really it, there's nothing much here. Oh no! Oh no! <gasps> it's Bowser! Oh no! There's more than one airship now! <gasps> oh no! Mushroom Kingdom's being attacked! Oh no! How dare you, Bowser! Oh no! I really like this airship theme. Oh no, Peach! Oh no! How has Peach got a Luma? That's what I didn't understand. Oh no, Peach! Oh no, here's the fat face himself! Princess Peach, you are formally invited to the creation of my new galaxy! Whoa, uh, uh, uh. The festival's over! Roar! <gasps> oh no, it's a UFO! Aliens! Aliens! Ah! Oh no, quickly go. Go Mario, go. Who cares about the toads? Just go. We. Is this, does this look like 64s? Kind of, yeah, it does kind of look like 64. Don't save the, I'll well, just save one, I'll save one. Oh no, I can't, oh, I can't shake yet. Oh, whoops. <laughs> Can we just go here? 
Yeah, we just go here. Yeah, it looks like 64 is Peach's castle. Yeah, it's even got the bridge and everything. Oh no! It's a UFO! We got aliens! <gasps> oh no! Oh no, they're taking the castle. Oh no! Why would they do such a thing? Why? Why? Oh no! Why would they do this? No! No, they got the chains too! They got everything! They planned this! They planned this all along! Why didn't we see this coming? Really, Peach needs to design better defenses from Bowser. At least Mario hitched a ride, but not for long. Not for long. Not for long. Uh oh. Mario's been spotted. Uh oh, spaghetti. -o. There's a Kamek, just one Kamek, you just stomp on his head! So long, enjoy your flight! Uh oh. Just dodge, quickly! Dodge, you idiot! No! And Mario dies, the end. How are they, like, they're, they're, they're in space, how are they not dead from, from breathing? Like, bre breathing nothing. But no air, no oxygen, no, oh, that, that Luma. Was that Peach's Luma? Ooh, Luma! Okie dokie. Ooh, it's a bunny wabbit. You're finally awake, let's play! Jump with B? Yeah, of course. Oh, I think in the in the Wii version it's A. So, in this one it's B. What does A do then? Nothing. Oh wait, no, A does, no, A does the same thing. A does the same thing! I think, I, I always find it easier to use B anyway. Use B and Y. I think there was one time I used Y and A, and that felt really weird. That was like when I first played like New Super Mario Bros. DS. So that was the first Mario platforming game I played. Oh, um, oh god. Where are those rabbits? Where are those rabbits? Let's go and find him. One's in the bush. Yep, there we go, gotcha. I'm gonna get ya. I keep thinking I can shake, but I can't shake yet. You caught me! Oh no! I've been caught! Oh, I knew it! I should've hidden the crater! The crater. Someone in the crater. Aha! Found ya! You're giving- No, they're, they're giving away the other hiding spots for the others! That's- That's really, really not good sportsmanship right there. Are you gonna tell me where the other one is? Oh, if only I hid it in the- Thank you for telling me where the others are. Just to, just because you get found doesn't mean you say where the others are. That is that is not good sportsmanship. That is not good sportsmanship. There we go. Wow, you caught all of us. Maybe you really can help Mama. Mama! <laughs> Here we go. Mama! <laughs> okay, we'll restore the observatory. Let's go. There's Mama Luma. I was gonna say Mama Luma. Mama Rosalina. I've been watching you from here. 
This is place is called the gateway to the starry sky. My name is Rosalina. I watch over and protect the cosmos. To save your special one, you'll need the power to travel through space. Luma can give you this power. I will entrust you with its care. How many companions has Mario had since 64? He's had Flood, Luma, Cappy. Oh my god, the list goes on. Okay, bye-bye, Rosalina. With no Luma. Rosalina and Luma! Rosalina and no Luma! <laughs> shake or press Y? I prefer pressing Y. I, I never... Um, I, well, you'd have to shake for the Wii version, but... I always prefer using buttons, thank you very much. I'm not using the shake for this time. Not this time. Okay. Hi there, good to see you. I have some bad news. Though... So, See, I had a launch star all ready for you, but a meteor smashed it up. You can't leave without it, so find all the star chips to fix it. Oh, and be sure not to fall into the black hole. Okay, alright. I really like this music. It is music to my ears. This game has the best lot of music. Oh, I almost died there. Well, I'll just get this one up for. Why not? it's there even though we don't really need one-ups on the first level anyway it's not like I'm gonna die easily there we go done and dusted let's move on we let's go Mario we I'm not sure if my volume's too loud, my game audio is too loud, because this is my first episode. If it's too loud, I'll turn it down. Also, there is one, I think there's at least one song in this game that can get you a copyright strike, so I think at least one of my videos won't be monetized. And that is Gusty Garden Galaxy, because I have still um, had copyright issues with Gusty Garden Galaxy. It's just Nintendo really loves that song, so they want to, um, make sure it's, um, it's, um, it, no one uses it, I guess, even though it's from the game. Because they got an actual orchestra to, to record this music, or at least most of it. Where do we go now? Where do we go now? We get the big guy. We get the big guy. We get big boy. Get the big boy. There we go. Another key. There we go. Let's get out of here. Let's get out of here. Oh crap! I'll just get a coin. That'll save me. Oh, oh, oh god! I don't like this camera angle. Okay, okay, let's move on. Hurry, down here. Okay, let's go down here. Oh, I can't, I keep slipping off the pipe. That's not very good. We don't want to slip off a pipe, do we? No, we don't. No, I've been waiting for you. <gasps> it's been waiting for me. That's a Grand Star. We had, had to save it. They're using the Grand Star to power that awful machine. Looks like it's making something. We have to do something before the Grand Star's power is drained. Quick, find a way to stop that terrible machine. It's funny, the first, um, the, the first, like, um, star we get, power star we get, is a Grand Star. Seems a bit weird for the first star, but apparently Grand Stars are worth the same amount as a normal star star like wouldn't you think like a grand star should be worth like three like the multi moons and odyssey but no it's only worth one or no no five would make sense grand star would would should be worth five because like the five points that would make more sense if a grand star was worth five um five stars but i guess if they did that then there would be 
less levels. Unless if they could rack up the, um, I don't know, the the amount of stars to like, um, 150 or something like that. I think 150 would have been better. Or 140, just something. Okay, well, we, we're almost done. Um, For at least, um, um, for the main part of the game, we're just going to um, do 20 minute episodes. I know, like, Odyssey was like, like half an hour episodes, but I'll probably go back to 20 minute episodes again, cause, um, cause this is, um, we want to make this game last, cause it's an amazing game. So, yeah, anyway, this is the introduction episode, so we can't really get much done in the introduction. But, um, yeah. Um, we might do one more level. I, I'm not sure if there's time, but... Um, we'll see. High score updated. You discovered a new galaxy. The Terrace, okay. Anyway, we've got cutscenes anyway. The beacon is lit again. Our shines weekly, maybe only as bright as a class six star, but at least the poor lemurs will survive now. Oh, thank you for saving the grand star. These star people are my family. They mean so much to me. Welcome to the Comet Observatory. It's my home and also my home to the lemurs. You see, we travel the starry skies. We pass by this area once every 100 years. But we suddenly stopped in front of this planet. A strange force had latched onto our ship, pulling away star bits and our power source, power stars. Our ship had lost power, so it entered a deep hibernation state in which it could not move. Those who took your special one picked up the power stars and discovered the power to cross the universe. Please, I have a request. This observatory uses star power to protect images of the galaxies that are scattered across space. And there's, there is a chance we could use our few remaining stars to look for another power stars. These round rooms are called domes. We observe galaxies from domes such as these. But the only one that is working now, powered by the star power you restored, is this one, the Terrace. Please go to the terrace and try to recover the power stars from the galaxies you can see from there. If we do that, we'll be able to restore the Comet Observatory's ability to fly like a pa oh, like a starship. <laughs> these, the, I'm stuffing up now. I've been talking for too long. It's like you kind of like lose focus and then kind of um, go lightheaded. But anyway, um, these pa perhaps. We can pursue the thieves who ran off with the power stars. Oh yeah, and then it finishes there when when I was um just went lightheaded. All right, um I think we'll probably end it about here because it's almost been 20 minutes, and I think 20 minutes is a good good length for these videos. But anyway, we'll just get um on some of the one-ups for the next episode. So let's do that quickly. Let's get the was one ups. I think it'll be harder to reach some of the other ones though. And this camera angle is locked. It, I don't like how this camera angle is locked. Oh, there we go. Can we get the one? Can we get one of the? Can we get the one up mushroom here? Let's just have a look. Can we get the one here? This is the easy one. Oh, it's not there yet. Okay. No! No! Oh, I died. Not exactly, but I'll say that's a death to me. Let's see if we can make it out here. Come on! There we go! That's skill! That's skill! Alright, um... Like, I, I, I love everything about this game. This game is a work of art. Like, even the background's good. It just got that very nice atmosphere. And seeing it in 1080p is amazing, amazing so... So, I, I really love that this game's on Switch now. So, yeah, yeah, this is the Switch version, not the Wii version. So, yeah, that's why the quality looks better. But, in fact, you can't get this anymore unless you get it on cartridge, or if you get one of those download codes. 
Or unless if Nintendo releases Super Mario Galaxy separately somehow. I don't know. I still want Galaxy 2 though, but we're not getting Galaxy 2 anytime soon on Switch. Ah. Well, anyway, guys, um, I guess that's it for today's episode of Super Mario Galaxy. So, I hope you enjoyed it. So, if you enjoyed it, hit that like button, share to your friends, and subscribe to the channel if you're new. And I guess I'll see you next time. Some more gaming. Bye.